our findings into the perfect equation that'll solve this week's question. Okay, what we're gonna need to do is we need to find a mathematician slash music expert. <laughs> Liam Lenton dismantles digits and bashes buttons at La Trobe University to figure out why people like certain types of music. So, uh, Liam, do you think that the number of fans impacts on how famous someone is? Yes, um, having a larger fan base is very much a measure of fame in music as it is in, let's say, the motion pictures, film and other facets of public life too, like politics. So, how does modern day fame compare to that of the past? Well, it differs in a number of different ways, Nicole. Not only how you measure fame, in the modern day we look at things like internet uh, streaming hits. Uh, if you go back a couple of decades ago, then you'd more be looking at unit sales of singles. So it depends on that, and also it depends on how much you discount time. So if you discount time a lot, you're more likely to think that whoever's the most famous musician right now might also be the most famous of all time. Hmm. He could be onto something there, Joel. Time, an element we have not discussed yet. Of course. But if I don't discount time so much, then I might be more inclined to look back to some of the big artists of the birth of pop music in the 60s, 70s, like the Beatles or Rolling Stones. If you discount time even less, then you might even be inclined to go back to the great classical composers of the 15th and 16th century, like Beethoven or Mozart. And Liam, in your professional expert opinion, who do you think is the most famous person in the music industry as of today? Well, considering, Joel, that many of the um, measures of fame that we tend to put more importance on are along the lines of internet technology, so how many hits that you're getting just generally in fan sites, um, social networking sites, as well as video streaming sites, um, I would probably more point towards someone like Lady Gaga or maybe Justin Bieber just behind. Well, thank you very much, Liam. It's been most informative. Thank you, Nicole. Thank you too, Joel. Thank you very much. More results for the whiteboard of fame. To Stackery. Hmm. Most informative. Hmm.